Hey guys, what is going on? My name is Hario Has One Bro, and today I'm going to be doing an update video on how to record your iPhone screen with every cord as you can see down there. So, um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to take you guys through every step I can think of and every step possible. So, as a lot of you guys have been having problems with it, so I'm actually going to delete App Valley just so I can take everyone through the same steps that I've gone through. So, if you are having problems, then please just watch the video, and if you're still having problems, then I want you to just tell me in the comments because I really want to help out as many people as I can because, yeah, that's what I want to do. So, as you can see at the top, I want to type in, I, if you haven't seen my last video, then yeah, this is what we did. So, www.appvalley.vip, you can see there at the top, so I'm just going to press go on that. And then it's going to come up with this little background, little blue screen. Click to install tweak taps, you want to press install at Valley, it's going to prompt you. And you just want to press install and um this is where some problems like lie as well because it's not always running it's not 100 percent at the time you know what i mean because these tweaked apps like apple try to ban them and stuff like that but they keep they keep fixing them so yeah you just want to install it and if it doesn't if it doesn't work it says it can't connect or whatever then either just keep trying and if it still doesn't then you know what i mean wait an hour because eventually it will work at some point in the day it's going to work i promise you guys but anyway once you got it installed it's going to ask you, I think most of the time it's going to ask you that it's an untrusted developer. But because I've already downloaded it, it's not going to say that. So what you want to do is you just want to go into general, go down to see profiles and device management, Shanghai, Ding, or whatever that says. And then here it just says delete apps for me. But for you guys, it should say verify unless you've had it already. So you just want to press verify and that's going to verify um, app value so you can go on it. So then what you want to do here, guys, you want to go into library apps and then you're gonna see every code now a big problem just like here a lot of people sometimes can't connect it like i said it depends what time of day it is depends like what the servers are if they're running properly and stuff but if you can't connect like i said retry keep retrying if you don't want to install then you just keep retrying and after a bit if you're still not working you're gonna press done try it again in an hour like i said and just you know just keep repeating that process until you've got it done because eventually guys you will get it done i promise you but then once you've got that you just press get and then install but once you've got that it's going to ask you for, your, for a few things like once you actually go into every record um you can't actually go into it now because it's going to stop the recording but you can work your way through that guys like you know you unless you're brain dead like i'm pretty sure you can get get your way through uh, every record but um I'm gonna go for another another few problems as well, which people have been having. When you actually record the video and press done at the end, it's gonna take it's uh, it's gonna say compile video for just for forever as long as you leave it. So what you wanna do is give it a minute or two just so it can like compile a bit. I don't I don't even know. That's what I figured out anyway. Give it a minute or two, and then you just wanna double tap your um, home button and then just swipe it up. Like you know like you know how to close an app. Close it. And then go back into it and if you go into my recordings it should be there there's going to be two of them it's going to be like a duplicate but you just want to go on the one no just go on any of them to be honest guys and then uh, if you just press info at the side there's like a little blue uh, info mark and you just want to press save to camera roll what that's going to do is it's going to allow you to import import it to uh, any app of your choice i use splice personally because it's just easy and it's the only one that i can find uh, so that's why it's a GoPro like editing app and it's it's really good it gets you gets you what you want and stuff so if you want to create a new project and you just want to press add and then you're just going to go onto the video that you've just recorded or whatever any of them and then it's going to um, it's going to take a while to do it because it's, you're importing it off your phone and your phone doesn't have that much power it's not a computer you got to remember that guys it's not a computer so it's going to take a while and nah, sh uh, you're just going to have to live with it but from here you're just going to have to work things out yourself you know what I mean get your editing done or whatever and then eventually you can press share and upload it to YouTube copy link or save it and then upload it to YouTube whatever you want to do so um those are all the problems I can think of I, I might have missed some out if I do miss them out then I'm going to I'm going to try and put it in the description or in the the comments or whatever because i don't know i think i think i've covered everything guys but it, like i said if you're still having problems then please please tell me in the comments because i really want to help everyone out and um yeah that's that's it really guys so if you did enjoy the video please sure to give it a like um comment your feedback tell me if you liked it tell me if it worked you know and uh, subscribe if you want to keep up to date with all the latest latest content i, I suppose so uh, see you later bye